Baz is in the studio. Yeah, well, Mark Best is one of Australia's most renowned chefs and restaurateurs. And in 2016, he teamed up with Dream Cruises, opening restaurants on each of their three luxury vessels. And he's here this morning. Mark, great to have you here. Hello, how are you? This is a great collaboration. Tell us, how did it all come about? Um, luck. And, uh, you know, as you said, as a bit of a celebrity um, back in 2016, I had a meeting of minds with the president, Thatcher Brown, and uh, he told me of his vision met my vision of uh, being on the sea and uh, off we went. Obviously they're a very different cruise line but how are they so different from other cruise lines because um, there's so many out there now. There are but I think we bring a, a certain style uh, there's a, a the degree of luxury that we bring to the seas the palace uh, suites are just incredible uh, the, the fretto sheets the best bathrooms on the sea the best and the best bedrooms as well um, the food offering I'm on board. Yeah, yeah, it's all very luxurious, isn't it? Now, you're actually going to be cooking up a treat, yeah. some of the food that we might expect on board. What are you going to cook for us today? So, I'm cooking a dish that's uh, called Murray Cod Three Rivers. So, we have the Murray Cod, which mm -hmm. is, uh, you know, local fish. Murray, uh, so, that's one river from the Murray River. We have stir-fried potatoes from northern China, uh, which is the Yangtze River. And so then it's we fancy have fish and chips. Fancy fish and chips. <laughs> we can't just serve, we've got to bring the fancy because otherwise we can't charge. And here we have some butter sauce, which is from the Loire River, so hence the three rivers. So a bit of storytelling, but ultimately just fancy fish and chips. Yeah, and, and that's what you do on the ship as well, isn't it? You're telling a story about all the different just, cultures. Just that you're telling a story with. about all the different cultures. Um, we, you know, come from a multicultural city like Sydney. Um, mm -hmm. And I like to tell that story about Australia, but also about where we travel as well and all around through Southeast Asia and also uh, Japan as well, Philippines, Thailand um, and down to Australia in October. Beautiful. Let's talk about Explorer Dream, mm. which is coming here to Australia. An incredible ship. Tell us all about it. Um, so... She's just an incredible luxury <laughs> mid-sized ship. Sorry, that's the, uh, the stir-fried potatoes. I was just going to say, it's got right into my throat there. <coughs> Have a look at that. That is incredible. Now, that's coming up in October. That has just gotten right into my, uh, into my throat. Sorry, this is... <laughs> I did warn you. <laughs> <laughs> it's right in... But it smells amazing, I've got to say. Oh, thanks, lad. Oh, hello. How good is that? Oh, how good does that smell? Nick, so, you right might on. need to finish that. I'm so like, this is something you. I discovered in the north of China. The potato, rather than you know mashed potatoes or yeah. steamed or whatever, I mean the potato is a crunchy vegetable. So it's something quite different. So I guess that's, that's sort of the cultural uh, exploration that you know we're getting with the, with the cruise lines as well. And we're going to bring some of that down to Australia. So off to New Zealand and Tasmania and out of Darwin, mm. Gladstone. Um, How, what, a, what an amazing opportunity. As we said, it kicks off in October. And to have this kind of luxury, and talking to you just before the segment, talking about the type of luxury in the rooms, the spa. But if you are a little bit of a foodie, you might not normally think you're going to get that on a cruise line. But we're getting such incredible food right across the board on this one. And it's just this, um, we have a butler service as well. But again, there's this relaxed luxury. There's no formal meal times. There's no formality. Um, we have so many different different offerings. Um, I'm the sort of the Western celebrity chef, but also obviously there's an Asian influence as well. Mm. And I think that um, you, you're getting this incredible experience on board and just the mm. destinations is this movable view. Absolutely. And it's amazing that you can experience at home as well. You can get more information on Dream Cruises. All you need to do is head to dreamcruiseline.com or, of course, our team at Seven Travel have some amazing packages kicking off, as I said, in October this year. Seventravel.com.au. Are fish you and coming chips? into Someone test said fish for and me chips. so that fish I can't? Chips. Fish and chips. We done also fancy, fancy style. <laughs> oh, wow. That, that looks so good. It smells incredible. Uh, I've got to go. Sorry. This is Kylie's cup that I gave you, and we only have one <laughs> cup of water to share. <laughs> Budget cuts. So make sure you head online, seventravel.com.au or dreamcruiseline.com and get more information. Make sure you are on board. That looks delicious. Make sure you're on yeah, board. Like it. Oh, yes, gee, that yes. smells. That smells beautiful. Just Enjoy that. Food. Yeah. We'll have the butler service ready for you, Kylie. Oh, thank you, Del. <laughs> I love it. Isn't it funny that I'm the one that saved your life over there and <laughs> Kylie gets a butler service. That's all right, Kaz. No you right. can have my fish, Laz. Yeah. <laughs> all right, thanks, Kaz. That's great. Thanks lovely, too. lovely stuff. Uh, still to come for you here on the